I think this this might do it. Um, let me try and see. It's not the ideal way to do it, but it does should hopefully work. Let's see. All right, so we are about to find out. This is gonna work. It does take a little bit to boot up, I've noticed. Oof, all right, let's see. Okay. All right. Let's watch the intro, of course, because we love these. Nothing beats the CD intro, but this is pretty solid, too. I like how Sonk just put his own name on the plane, like people aren't gonna know whose it is. Uh, oh, goodness. I could have just hooked up my PS5 or used the built-in stream, but it's too much work. Although, getting this to work was also some work, so... There we go. Alright, let's see. Start. Oops. Forget the A and B are swapped on. <laughs> All right, let's see. Oh god, yeah, I'm trying to emulate the Switch version. Oh, I guess I did play a little bit. There we go. Okay. And we gotta play as Sonic, of course. Even though he's kind of the worst one to play as in this. Such is life. There's my boy Fang. It's been too long since I've seen his purple ass. I'm waiting for them to release a Fang Fang figure so I can add it to my collection. They'll probably do a trip one too. I'm so glad that Sonic went back to doing classic and modern. Like modern. I like okay. It's really, it's really all about the classic though with Sonic. Uh, the concessions they had to get to run this on a Switch and probably just on this emulator too. I mean, I'm not emulating it, Twitch. Haha, <laughs> that would be bad. I love that this game, a very Sega thing to happen, this game just getting leaked days before release and like cracked and everything. Let's see how this runs on here. <laughs> Definitely feels worse than the PS5, obviously, because, oopsie. Because. Oopsie. Off to a good start, as always. I think I beat this game in like two or three days. It's not long. Oh. So, and the first time I got through it, I didn't get all the emeralds in the first run, but it's good to at least get this first one. This power is very useful. That, you know, it's super easy to get, obviously. That's a weird special stage, you like, grab and swing and stuff. Do, 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 do. We'll see how much of this we get done tonight. Uh, I will say, this game gets kind of difficult near the end. Yes, that's a good ability. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna clone. Oh 
god. <laughs> All right, we'll see how this runs. Obviously, my computer is more powerful than the Switch and be able to stream at all, but... I mean, this emulator is still kind of a little wonky, too. They said the mechanics are supposed to be pretty much one-to-one -one to Mania, which... I don't know, I think they might be. It just, it doesn't seem that way sometimes because of the graphics, I guess. Very great special stage. The only thing is there's not... Exploration is really not that, like, important in this one, which is which is fine for a Sonic game, I guess. I mean, the only thing you get is, need to get is the emeralds. The other stuff's all, like, multiplayer stuff, which... You know, I'm pretty sure you have to have PlayStation Plus for that. I'm sure it's not one of those ones where it's, like, free to play online. There we go, a little jump. Uh-oh. <laughs> that little, I like that little vault he does over it. Oh shit. Oh, just made it. <laughs> wow. Almost died at the first boss. It's all good, though. <laughs> that was the right button, right? I think. <laughs> I feel bad for developers having to release games on every system, because like, oh shit, we gotta get this thing to run on Switch. <laughs> I guess Nintendo is working on a Switch successor, supposedly. Oh my god. Wow. <laughs> it's like, it's gonna be as powerful as the PS4. It's like, wow, last gen system. Very cool. Oop, this is not running great. Once again, I'm just gonna blame the emulator. I like that. Oopsie, oh, that's fine. Nothing useful there. People are like, Sonic sucks, it's all just about going fast, and I'm like, hell yeah it is. It, like it's a bad thing. Oh, it does want me to. Okay. <laughs> we. This game wants you to go left more than a lot of Sonic games do. <laughs> uh oh! Oh damn it! That's fine. <laughs> Oh god. <laughs> it's okay, the game just dropped, went down to two frames for a second. That's fine. No, oh, that's fine too. <laughs> I hear Alyssa yelling at Fortnite in there. Oh, what up, Mark? How's it going? Uh, Switch emulator's running. Um, <laughs> okay. Having a l few hiccups, but that's, you know, that's how it goes, I suppose. How you doing, boy? Those wings were good tonight. They did a good job. They really doused them. Thinking about them right now. Think about having some more. Good. Now we're gonna have more beer tomorrow. Hooray. I'm just gonna... <laughs> I love this ability. <laughs> just have a bunch of freaking kamikaze Sonics. Are they just gonna take out the boss for me? <laughs> they probably will. Yep, they, they did it. That's why you want that first emerald. Thinking about them wings. Oh, I forgot. There's a second phase. Of course there is. Oopsie. Okay, there he goes. <laughs> Alright. And that's the end of him. Do, 
So yeah, like I said, this is run, running the Switch version on a Switch emulator. So, <laughs> you know, it's not gonna be perfect. Even when you boot up the emulator, it's like, it will break at points. <laughs> the game will... <laughs> things will not be as they should be. I actually had kind of a problem getting it to even display this. I had to switch to display capture instead of game slash window capture, but whatever. You gotta do what I gotta do for the stream. There's our boy, there's Fang. We love him here. Big Fang fans. Me just suckling on that beer. <laughs> My back. I was finally got some a little bit of exercise today and got some shots up. I, you know, I should post in the city subreddit to find a rec team. I don't know why I hadn't thought of that earlier. How's the sound and everything? Everything good? Oh my god, just dropping frames. Once again, that's, it can't be my PC. It's got to be this emulator. <laughs> I will not allow it to be my PC. Sounds good. Okay. This song is kind of a banger. A lot of people are really like, I don't like any of the uh, shit, what's his name, Senyo songs on this, but they like all the T Lopes ones. I'm like, I've pretty much like all the songs in this. I don't think there's any real bad ones. Oh, I need. Can I get that? I can't remember how I get that. Is this gonna kill me? Nope, okay, cool. Oh, maybe I can't get that one. Let me. I'm gonna see if I can restart the level. It's. It's kind of hard to get all the emeralds in, like, the first run just because, like... It's just, like, hard to see all of them. Like, there's just not... Like, in Sonic 3 and Knuckles, there's, like, there's a million opportunities to get emeralds that are just hidden. This one, I don't think there's that many. Like, if you miss one, it's like, good luck. <laughs> or miss a, if miss a few. There were, there were... The last one did take me a little bit to, like, get, so... Oh, what? Where am I going? Okay, cool. Um, I think this top one maybe will get me there. Nope. <laughs> I don't know where I'm going. Ow. <laughs> that little mechanic's a little game. Oh. I don't think I ran into that the first time where a little dragonfly bad nick takes away away my uh, my box, huh? Oh, there's there's that ring again. Oh, there we go. I just went right through there. Okay, cool. Alright, so let's see if I can get the second one at least. These are odd stages. I don't know if I like them. I think if I got good at them, I would probably like them. I feel like I'm just kind of out of control on these. I mean, the first few are, like, not too hard, so... Uh, come on. I say as I struggle to get it. There we go, okay. Well, I, can't, I like that the, each emerald gives you a power in this. That's a nice new little thing with like, I don't know, with not, not interfering with the classic Sonic formula too much, but also like giving it some updates because it's like there's that balance you gotta strike with classic where it's like, oh, you don't want to be like completely like modern, but it's like it does have to evolve at some point. Like, because honestly, I wanted Mania 2, but this is good, but I get why they went this direction. Like, it's, it's base, it is, I think, canonically a sequel to Mania 2. And like, I don't know, I mean, and like, Yuji Naka had kind of gone on record to say, he's like, I don't think there's really a future for like, 3D, or like, for like, pixel art Sonic. He's like, it's just not the direction the game's companies are going, because it's old, and it's like, well, yeah, but... I guess indie developers make a lot of 16-bit stuff still, so and like 32-bit, but like, I get why, I kind of get why Sega doesn't want to, as much as I, I would, I like Sonic in 16-bit, but this look has grown on me, it's just, classic Sonic looks best in like pixel art or like hand-drawn anime style, that would have been really cool for this, but like, I don't know, it's just, it is sad to see that, that go away, but also, 
I don't know. I mean, I get it. Like, but the thing is, I bet if this game had the like the pixel art style, like, because Mania was like a steal for what Mania was. Mania was like 20 bucks on release, and it was like you know 16 bit. I guess it was technically 32 bit their style, and like, but I bet if Sega like, because this is a 60 dollar game, so like almost full price. But I feel like part of the reason they went with this is because they knew people weren't gonna pay like sixty dollars for for the sixteen bit look just because of like their biases. There's tails in the background. I like how you see your homies like doing stuff in the background when you're not playing multiplayer. And like I haven't played multiplayer at all because you know they've locked it behind freaking couch co-op. I'm like, who else my friends has this game who's gonna come over and play it with me? No, I'm not gonna make Alyssa play this, like <laughs> So, I don't know. <laughs> they should have made that. They should have made that online. I probably would have bought it on Steam then, so I wouldn't have had to pay for online. Oh, oopsie, that was dumb of me. Oops. Also dumb of me. Are you playing Spider-Man, Mark? Spoderman? Oops, I probably used that a little too early. Oh, no, I did. All right, he's dead. <laughs> oh, that was easy. Yeah. Um. Yeah. Sadly, it's okay. I won't be offended if you want to play Spidey. It's all good. I don't think this is gonna be as popular as our Fortnite streams. <laughs> I think that's more of a crowd pleaser. Have to change my schedule around, oh damn. Why is that? Don't tell me someone's like, oh I gotta we gotta do a conference tomorrow now. Tell them no because you have plans. <laughs> I can see like little visual artifacts in this uh in this uh Emulator too. God, no good. Yeah. What's going on with your schedule? Just, just the class schedule in general. Oh my god. The Switch trying to run this game. I like all the memes of like PS4 trying to run Spider-Man 2. It's just like a freaking like, I don't know, like gas fire or something. Oh, Fang, you rap scallion. Oh fuck you, Fang. I can tell you that he's in the foreground. I kind of like how in each of these, oh, each character gets, each character gets their own distinct act too, like one where you have to play through it with them. Oh, I'm dumb. I keep mistiming that. I swear. Some kids are pulled out for intervention, miss certain subject. Oh, the, oh yeah. Yep. Classic. I, I always kind of had an issue with that. Like, cause it's just like, I get that they have to be pulled out for like OT and like speech and stuff, but it's like. Okay, but then they, like, miss stuff in their other classes. I get there's not really a good, like, solution for that, but... Oh, why did I go to the special stage? Is this even worth my time? Probably not. Just the medals, yeah, they're really- these are only, like, for, like, multiplayer stuff, so... So really not worth my time here, but... Let's see. Yeah, this is- like, you see how these special stages are? You have to, like, time your swings and stuff? Oopsie. I'm just gonna drop, I don't care. Whee. Fuck you guys, I don't need your medals. Doink. Kids need more reading support, but you make sure they don't miss math. Yeah, late, right? You got yeah, right, yeah, I know, that's... Uh, like, it's, it's just, it is a tough, like, situation. Cause like, you know, you want them to get all the subjects. Just pull them from math. No one needs math, lol. I've I don't have math, and look how I turned out. Oh wait. <laughs> yeah, maybe maybe the kids do need math. I'm bad at math. Can't do it. Honestly, I'm good with fractions and shit though, because fractions are like kinda fun. Like a weird way, I don't know. Oh look who's back. 
Okay, I don't know why it would kill Sonic Team to add the... Fuck. The, um... The fucking Super Peel Out back. It costs you nothing, Sega. Add it back. CD was right in adding it. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, I need some rings. Aw, oh, damn it. Wow. Very sad. All my homies say fuck math, that's right. Measuring and shit, yeah. Um, I- and when I originally placed I had not died until, like, probably the fifth level. Just a humble brag about my Sonic skills, because that's all I really have in life. Just let me have this. I always mistime that fucking move. I pushed the button! I know, I, like you were saying, Mark, I think I probably will get Wonder at some point, but it's gonna be like a long time since I'll be pretty busy with this and Spider-Man. I mean, N Nintendo games never fucking go on sale, but like... I don't know, maybe I'll put it on like a list or something for like, gift, I don't know. I probably won't buy it soon, but I think if there's like a game drought, I'll probably buy it. <laughs> but yeah, I'm, I'm gonna be balls deep in Spider-Man though. God, it did my heart good though at the beginning of the game, when you first see Miles and Peter suit up, I was like, oh my god. It heals me. Cures years of generational trauma. Dudes will see two Spider-Men and literally just say, hell yeah. Absolutely. Get wonder on it. Yeah. That, that was pretty cool, the Sandman battle, yeah. I'm hoping to see Mysterio. I actually don't know if he's in it. I thought I saw him in the trailer, but it might have been the other green stuff that that Craven was using. I don't know. Let's see. Ah, no, not that way. Boing, boing, boing. There's very few power-ups in this game either, I realize. I kind of wish they brought the elemental shields back, but like, they don't really need them for the- I don't know. I like the power-ups a lot in Sonic, but I'm okay with them not being like a huge focus. I, I have a lot of thoughts on this game, but I, but I really mostly like it. Like, like when people say I have a lot of thoughts on something, that's usually like they don't like it. But I I have a lot of thoughts, but you know they're mixed. Mo like I said, mostly good. I, I do enjoy this game quite a bit. Was that? I made yeah. Completely absent, yeah. I know, I would- I would like to see Mysterio, I like him a lot. It'd be cool to see Jackal, too. Dude, um, they're, uh... So, the, the Spider-Man comics are just in a really awful state right now because fucking Zeb Wells is, like, writing the worst Spider-Man story ever, apparently. But, they're bringing back Ultimate, and they're doing, like, and it's Hickman writing it, who's like, is it, uh, Hickman or Kirkman? Both of them are good, but, like, in January they're bringing back like an ultimate Spider-Man universe stuff and it's gonna be like him and MJ married with kids and it's like not gonna be just like torturing Spider-Man even though I do love writers torturing Spider-Man it's like there's a limit like you gotta give him some wins oh man hmm. my eyes are kind of tired but wear my contacts all day it's rare for me I feel like I pretty much only have contacts for like when I want to look like really, really hot, you know, <laughs> like at a wedding or something, or like when I'm in a suit, or I have them for like running and basketball. <laughs> but I want to get LASIK. I don't really like this level gimmick. <laughs> I'm sorry. This like light up one. <laughs> But yeah, I'm trying to think, um, yeah, Mysterio, Jackal. <laughs> I'm sure there'll be a Spider-Man 3, I have no idea how this one ends, but... People think there's gonna be a Venom game, so that could be something, I don't know. 
but <laughs> I would love to see them. Oh, that, this is gonna kill me? Oh my god. Oh, okay, no, we're not. I was gonna say, that's a very long fall. I don't know where it's going. Okay, we're going this way. I wonder. I kind of doubt they have this option on PC, but I wonder if you can run the PC version of this. Like the actual PC version, like not this emulated version. I wonder if you can run it at 120 FPS without any modding. That would be cool. I mean, I probably can't on mine. I probably, you probably need a really beefy. I'd probably have to put on like Lego mode. Oh, fun fact. That's uh, Splats, who was originally a cut bad Nick from Sonic 1 that they brought back in Mania in this. There's a really cool reference to in a. Uh... Oh, you know what? I can just use this. There we go. I do like how these powers last a long time. Oh, ouch. A Venom game based on the two movies, God. <laughs> I'm thinking it's going to be a spinoff. <laughs> I, it's funny, I own the first Venom movie because I got it in that cool Spider-Man Steel book that had like Spider-Verse, uh, Homecoming, and Far From Home. But like, I've never watched Venom or Let There Be Carnage and they seem bad. Like, let's make a Spider-Man villain movie without Spider-Man. And then let's do it again with the fucking Morbius. Oh, wait. I don't know why it wants me to do that there. The emerald powers are nice too because they last a long time and they recharge at every every signpost and you can use all of them like when one goes it's like oh you can just use the next one and then hit a signpost and get them all back again. Oh, whoops. Was I, that's going to kill me, huh? Nope. Because they're fan favorites to make them a great stand alone move. Yeah, no, exactly. It's just. And they're doing like a. I don't know. They were doing a Madam Web movie too. But like, I don't. I don't fucking know. Who knows? Oh, oopsie. I forgot this is what his attack is at first. There we go. <laughs> and a lot of people complain about the bosses in this because they're like, oh, you have to like wait for them to do this huge cycle. I'm like, yeah, I get it. Like, but they're they're pretty creative bosses overall. I don't know. I don't think they're that bad. Oh, come here. There we go. Oops. Got it. But yeah, some of the cycles are a little annoying on the bosses, but... Hmm. There we go. <laughs> you big dumb animal. Oh, that was dumb of me. There we go. <laughs> there we go. Give me the fruit. Hello, there go the little Pockies and- oh wait, no, it's not Pocky. I can't remember what the pig's called. Pocky's the rabbit, Flicky's the bird, Porky, I don't know, Porker. Ooh. I don't really like this next zone. <laughs> no Trip. So, fun fact about Trip, Trip is a, a sun gazer lizard and so, Naoto Oshima is one of the guys who designed, um, 
the original Sonic characters, like the classic designs. So this is the first time Naoto Oshima has been back make, helping with the games for a long time. And that's the, the first modern or classic design character he's designed in a long time. So a lot of free Sonic facts from this. This kind of kind of feels like Mania Light with like, <laughs> you know, all the all the facts I'm able to throw in there. Ooh, goodness! Nope. Oh, there goes Knuckles, my boy. Okay, we. Dudes will see a. It's, <laughs> I can't talk sometimes on stream. Dudes will see a blue hedgehog going fast and just think, hell yeah. Alright. Okay, let's see if I can get that third Chaos Emerald. Ugh. October's always a, has always a good month, but it's been an especially good month this year. Because, you know, NBA always starts up in October, starts to get cold in October. But this year, all that happened, and I got a new Sonic and Spider-Man game. Everything's coming up Millhouse. Whee. But my wife did leave me, too. No, just kidding. She, she would never. Oh, damn it. I missed it. Very sad. That's okay. <laughs> you really don't need the Chaos Emeralds to beat the game. I mean, I'd probably make the last boss easier if you can keep that many rings all the way to the last boss, but... Honestly, it wouldn't do that much against him. There's a lot of pitfalls in that one. <laughs> Alright, let's see. No Hypersonic. I... <laughs> I know this won't happen, but I'm hoping they add Hypersonic as DLC. And I, I wouldn't be surprised if they add Mighty and Ray as DLC, continuing that from Mania. If I really want to dream, maybe they'll add the, Cha the original Chaotix team, too. But, it seems like Mania was more the place to, like, do all my Sonic fantasies, if you know what I mean. What the fuck? How'd that hit me? Is it the tail end of that? Dudes will see colorful pics the movie across the screen and think, hell yeah! Oh, this like this like really like just fueled my autism as a child. Like I I would fucking like on those old CRT TVs I'd be playing Sonic 2 on my Model 2 Genesis, and I would just bump the fucking contrast up all the way so it looked like so bright and obnoxious. And I'd be like, oh this is awesome. It'd be like Green Hill Zone like all cracked out. I think I can get that ring if I go once I get back in the. I get back in the background? I don't know. I probably won't- I don't know. I'm not gonna go too out of my way to get emeralds in this run, probably. Last level is pretty annoying, but whatever. Once you get through it, though, and, like, get to some signposts, it's like, okay. Whatever. This is God intended, yes. Ooh. Oh, damn it. Uh Okay. 
Everyone's favorite part of Sonic, Super Breakout. I don't really mind these parts, though. They're kind of fun. Until I do that and I go backwards. Like that. Like that, yeah, good. That's what I, that's what I meant to do. Oh, I can actually control them a little bit here. Oops, I just thought it was all automated. It's not like I beat the game or anything. Okay, there we go. Alright. Alright. I don't know. <laughs> hope they do add in 120 FPS mode. I think they could do it on PS5. I just have to bump the resolution down a little bit, which should be fine. Oopsie. Oh, that was dumb. Oops. Okay. Got too excited. Got too hyper. This way? There's something up there? I feel like there's something hidden up there, maybe. Oh, an alternate route with nothing hidden? Okay, that's fine, please, I suppose. Uh oh. Am I gonna die? Did I go too far? Probably. Nope, I'm fine. <laughs> okay. That works. Okay, I'm like, so, after you beat it, you can play through the game as this other character. And I'm like stuck on this boss, and I don't remember it being that hard in this mode, but we'll find out. I swear, I think it's a little harder in her mode, I'm not sure though. This helps you in boss fights a lot. This is, <laughs> I got stuck on this with Trip in the, uh, on my PS5 version, and I was like, you know what, I'm just gonna buy Spider-Man right now, so I was too frustrated, so I did. This boss is very disorienting, too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think it is because there's like less blocks to like stand on. Yeah, that's definitely harder in Trip's version. Okay, yeah, see, that was super easy in this one. I think it's because you beat the game already, and then if you beat it with Trip, it's like, it, it, it's a little different and a little harder. 
I don't need to try that again. I feel like I was just shitting the bed when I was trying to do it last time. <laughs> I think it's just you and me, Mark, and maybe another person. I think the people come to see Alyssa. I keep telling her that, but she doesn't believe me. So the Fortnite streams definitely get a few more. <laughs> All good, though. I do it for the the thrill of the hunt. Or the joy of the, the love of the game. <laughs> yeah, that's it. I <laughs> do I didn't do it because I wanted to teach him a lesson. I did it for the joy of killing. Let's see. What time is it? I got a little more left in me. If this game loads. <laughs> I definitely like the PS5 controller better for, like, Sonic games because I like the D-pad placement better than it is on the Xbox. It wouldn't be Sonic without a classic Sonic without like a really obnoxious carnival circus casino themed level, but I like them, so it's fine. Not even complaining, just Oh. Alright, that works. Gotta show those feet to get more viewers, that's true. Playing it on here just makes me want to go play it on my PS5. Ding, ding, ding. I think my favorite level of this type, though, is Casino Night Zone from Sonic 2. I love Casino Night Zone. I don't like Carnival Night Zone, though, in Sonic 3 and Knuckles. Not my favorite. This one is pretty good, though, too. I don't know why. Carnival Night Zone, I don't like the original theme that much, and I don't like the, the one they had to do for Origins with the replacement music. And I just, I don't like the barrels. I just don't think it's that fun of a level. Woo! <laughs> Some of these bosses I don't even know if I know how to do. I just use I just use the Avatar Sonic thing. I don't even know where I am. Oh ouch. He's vulnerable now. There we go. Creepy AF. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Is... Oh, look at it. Big old porker. I like all these, these big, like... The little... <laughs> the big versions of the animals they added in this. So I guess they finally, like, said, like... Because, like, in the Genesis games, it seems like Sonic is, like, kind of on his own planet without people. And then by adventure, it's like, oh, he's on Earth with, like, actual humans. And it was like, in the cartoon Sonic X, it's like, or the anime, sorry. It's like, oh, he's like, um, it's fruit? I'm trying to remember what this one is. Yeah, so, and so in Sonic X, it's like, oh, he gets transported and him and Robotnik and all the, all the other guys from, like, another world. But in adventure, they've said, like... It's like, oh, Sonic's always been on Earth, and it's like, what? <laughs> Has he? And so now they've kind of clarified, like, so the like the a lot of the animal creatures kind of stick to the islands, and the humans are mostly in the big cities and stuff. So that's why, like, <laughs> yeah, so that's that that makes sense, because like, you know, classic timeline is supposed to be the past, but like with Sonic Generations, it's like, oh, they crossed over with time travel shit, and then. You know, Mania ties into forces because of the, the Phantom Ruby. And so they're connected, and they're also happening at the same time. Kind of, well, not really the same time, but there's more time travel fuckery in that. 
Because Classic Sonic shows up in Forces, too. And even in Mania, when he, like, warps away after you beat it with Super, like, it shows that, like, that's where he was, kind of. So, I don't know. So, like, <laughs> now the timeline's a little fucky, because it's, like, I don't know. I mean, it's, it's Sonic. You can't really expect it to be super, like, sharp canon, even though they've kind of employed one of the comic writers, Ian Flynn, to, like, help write some of the games. Like, he wrote some of Frontiers, and it references and canonizes a bunch of other stuff, but, yeah. But, yeah, that, that fucking clown boss, fucking Pennywise. Okay. Um, I think I can do... I don't know if I want to do one more act. Let me just call it there. No, I don't want to go to the shop. Alright, I think... I think I should just auto-save. Alright. We could watch the intro. I don't know if you saw the intro. Could let the intro play while I... Oh, nope. Don't want to pull up Chrome on that side right now. But we'll play the intro and then I'll probably call it. <laughs> I'll let's see if it should fire up in a sec. <laughs> God, running this at fucking Switch resolution. Like I said, not quite Sonic CD intro, but it's a good intro. I'm trying to remember what the islands are called in this. I can't remember if it's just the South Islands, because, like, they have different... There's different islands in, like, Sonic 1, 2, 3, CD, Knuckles. I like that Origins, like, added these to the class, Like, these, like, animated intros and cutscenes to the classic games. To make it in line with Mania in this. There's definitely been a little bit of revisionist history in some of these, but that's fine. Oh. Uh, oh, goodness. My boy, Fang. He used to be Fang the Sniper, now they're calling him Fang the Hunter, because apparently it was too violent for the children. Okay, let's go to... Oh, you know what? I'm just gonna... Yeah, it's not bad. Fang the Hunter, yeah, I know. It's not doesn't have quite the same ring to it. Alright, let's uh let's see if we can raid someone. Thanks for hopping in, Mark. Uh let's see, arcade streaming. A lot of people are streaming tonight. I think. Hmm. I wonder who we should raid. Let's play the intro again. Oopsie, that's not the right. I always go the wrong thing. Stream manager. Creator dashboard. Stream manager, there we go. I don't know why I always forget that. Let's just do Lively Raccoon. Alright. Let's go. Time to take my contacts out. 